Well, local visual artists are getting their chance to shine at the Something in the Water Festival this weekend as well. Pharrell recruited many locals to cover the oceanfront with murals and pop wall structures. Penny Sides' Tamara Scott spent the day tracking them down. What'd you find, Tamara? Well, right here where I'm at, you can see some of these pop-up wall art displays that are on display right now. You also see some wall murals around here. It's what they're calling the Something in the Water Art Walk. And it's really just a compilation of different ideas and meanings. But at the root of it, it's meant to show what this area has to offer and that this festival is really just the beginning. They talked about this idea of, uh, of leaving something behind with the festival in terms of what that would look like as visual art. It looks like 13 murals painted by 12 local artists. You know, there's something in the water here that, that has created so many great talents, past, present, and future. Brandon B. Mike Odoms comes all the way from New Orleans to help with the big project he says Pharrell recruited him for. It wasn't long before he found inspiration for one of the biggest pieces off 17th Street. I was blown away by these young people um, they, they created this, this spoken word piece, this poem, that's directly in response to the festival. And, um, and in that poem, they use the term something in the water. And they say, yes, there's something in the water, and it's us. Three teens from Teen with a Purpose displayed as an example of what Hampton Roads has to offer. Celebrating the people of, of Virginia, you know, and making this into to something that is sacred for all of us, you know, that we can return our public spaces into this sacred shared space. But what does it mean? How will these pop up wall structures and wall murals that stretch all throughout the festival area live on past the last set on Sunday night? All the artists as you see creating, you know, this is opportunity for them to kind of put that flag up to say I'm here and, and this is who I am. This is my story. This is our story. Because when it's all said and done, one thing is clear. There's something in the water here. Now, B. Mike is the actually only artist who is working on this who's not from the area. But of course, there are tons of other local artists working coming up at six in just an hour. I'll introduce you to one local artist and I'll show you what he's working on and also why he says this is important for him to be a part of. For now, Virginia Beach, I'm Tamara Scott, 10 on your side. Thank you.